Am I the asshole if I tell my wife to stop exposing my daughter to her wicked beliefs? Oh shit, yeah, we're it's about to get real. I've been with my wife for 12 years. First of all, I'm gonna stop you right there. Uh, Gary, is it? You've been with your wife for 12 years. You went to a bar, found some goth hottie with big jubbles, and she said, I'm really into sigils. And you were like, Where? <laughs> you better wear. You were like, damn, girl. That book of shadows looks tight as fuck. And then 12 years later, you're like, why are you telling my daughter that forest spirits are real? You are too late. She's been filling your house with candles this whole fucking time. Okay, one crotch goblin pops out and now everybody's having a conniption fit. When did you last go to church, Gary? She's always been interested in spiritual cult things. You already knew what it was, girl. Astrology, tarot cards, sage cleansing, nothing negative like hexes or ghosts. <laughs> okay. Sure, champ. <laughs> My wife spends all this time in the golf course, but she doesn't play golf. <laughs> Most importantly, she's never been hardcore about it. Yeah, there's just candles everywhere. There's like tapestries on the wall. She's got a whole bookshelf. Full-time job, well-adjusted socially. She says she is an in the broom closet, which is not like you, Gary, you know being in the closet is bad, right? Gary, this is a signal that she is lying to people for her safety and her mental health. That's not good. Lots of books on the topic, but she hides them when either of our parents come over. I don't believe in any of it. I can tell, baby. I let her read my palm or cards, but I don't take it seriously. She uses it to channel her energy and improve herself. Yeah, she just likes doing it. Luckily, isn't into the death, skulls, bones, goth angle. So you're telling me she has a closet full of books and you don't think she has a single skull? No bones? Okay. Bones are cool. Can you not get behind it? She's slowly starting to introduce this stuff to our 10 year old daughter, like you do with things that you enjoy. I think my wife is getting more into it now that she has someone to play with. They sage cleaned our new apartment and they burn incense and do yoga and buy crystals. They never shut up about Halloween and watch Tim Burton to blow off Christmas. When my daughter is upset, she will burn incense and use crystals. My daughter started telling friends at school that she's pagan and a witch and they reject her and she thinks she's weird. My wife doesn't define herself as a witch. To you, she fucking doesn't, Gary. Fellas, is it cringe to watch Tim Burton movies with your child? Yeah, fellas, is it cringe? Fellas, is it is it cringe to share the things you enjoy and appreciate with your human child? The dude's vibes are not good. Like he is, this is a good one because he really thinks that he's in the right and he's not presenting himself well. My wife wants to take her to pagan festivals, which I won't attend, but I'm sure are full of weirdos. My wife's not pushing the depressing goth angle, but I'm worried my daughter will grow up pigeonholed in this weird, dark, spiritual realm, unequipped to deal with the issues of the real world. How do I tell my wife to chill on this stuff until she is older? I mean, now that she actually has someone to share herself with, she's getting more excited about it. What a fucking shock. Yeah, for real, dude. Also, like, weird of you to describe your wife's deeply held spiritual beliefs as, ha like, something she's playing. Like, now she has somebody to play with. He set himself up to look like a piece of shit. Like, okay, here's the thing. What he's saying is, I have nothing. She thinks this is cool. My daughter enjoys it, and I think they both need to shut up. This is the other thing, too. He's made it exceptionally clear that, like, his daughter is not doing anything harmful. So for 12 years, my wife has been hiding who she is because I can't handle her weirdo shit, but my kid is now interested. So she's doing her weirdo shit with my kid. I think my daughter should stop it. And I'm the asshole. Exactly. If there's a particular behavior or a particular practice or something that you're worried about. Like if you're worried about your daughter's like socialization in school, that's a conversation you can have with your wife. But the conversation you can have with your wife is cut it out. <laughs> Don't say you want a big titty goth girlfriend unless you're ready to commit to her dark ways for real. All right, let's see the Reddit take. You're the asshole. Your wife's spiritual beliefs are as valid as any other religion or form of spirituality. Why shouldn't she share it with your, her daughter who's clearly willing and interested? Parent is a joint effort if they didn't previously discuss how to tackle introducing re religion or spirituality to a child, then the mom is the asshole. No, 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 no. You, if you did not talk about this ahead of time, you both fucked up and you both need to go to couples therapy and now you need to talk about it. But she's not the asshole for assuming something was fine and fine finding out after the fact that he's not okay with it when he didn't say shit. It's his responsibility to communicate things that make him uncomfortable. He can do that in a way that's reasonable. He can say, hey, I'm like uncomfortable with this and they can talk about it. He's had 10 years to talk to his wife about this. Why is she responsible for making sure that he brings up his own concern? Part agree, baby. You're afraid that your daughter is gonna grow up to be like your wife. Many of the things you mentioned aren't Wiccan pagan anyway. Yoga, incense, and sage cleansing are quite mainstream things to do in Indian cultures. You sound like a judgmental twat. The world is full of weird those, not just pagan festivals. Yeah, that's the other thing too. I do not like the implication that acting like his wife is somehow a problem, right? Yikes. 